How's it, how's it, YouTube? How you doing? Hope you're doing good. So today, we are unboxing a tennis racket. It's a Dunlop. Let me see if I remember that. It's a Dunlop Blaze 3.0 series. I hope I'm correct, but we'll know soon enough. And this is the package it comes with. This is some type of cloth. I don't know what type of cloth is this. But it does seem like it won't, it won't break anytime soon. Seems a bit strong. But let's look at the guy himself inside here. So, so, woo, there we go. Alright. So, this is the guy. Oh, has a price tag here. Yeah, I got it for... 850 maybe it's cheaper somewhere else i don't know but i got it for 850 and it's quite light i must say it's quite light i will know shortly what is the weight of it but feels good i like this frame it has here this light frame so let's see what they have to say about it the construction, I take it this is the frame structure here. It says it's a premium alloy. So this is an alloy frame it has here. Um, the swing type is for medium to moderate. Well, I don't know if that's going to work out okay with me, but it will have to work. Tengile, tengile. So um, head size, the head size, it says here it's a hundred square inches i am not sure what size is that in centimeters or millimeters and the string pattern at 16 by 19 the unstrung weight is 260 grams for the po 3 and then for the elite 3.0 it's a, it's a 270 gram so this is the blaze 3.0 series this one here, it's the Elite. Um, you will see here, Blaze Elite 3.0. So this one size is 270 grams. And then the unstrung balance for the Po 3.0, it's 330 mil millimeters. And the Elite is 320 millimeters that same information you can get on a record itself there's the string pattern there is the unstrung balance 320 millimeters the string tension the unstrung weight of the 270 grams and the head size 100 square inches and the length is 27 inches so there's the record it comes with a stopper which is awesome but there's the racket let's see if we take out there there so here's how the racket looks it doesn't help that's how the racket looks it's got the dunlop pattern inside the grip let's see if i can break this so that we can feel how the grip is well, the grip is actually quite nice the grip is quite nice i must say this is a nice grip. Okay. So there it is, guys. The grip is quite nice, I must say. It's really not too bad. It does grip on your in your hand. Others you find them a bit silky and spins a lot. But this one, once I grab it, it's really not slipping. Maybe I might put a over grip on it. But it does hold nicely i must say it does hold nicely otherwise it seems like it's a 
fairly good racket it's not a very very expensive racket uh, i saw records that were easily over three and a half thousand so this at 850 you know uh it will do the job i'm not a professional player i just play for social and to have fun so i guess it will do it feels good it shall have to do the work that's that i hope you're doing good i hope you're doing well i hope everything is going great by you and you're heading for those dreams if not i don't know what you're waiting for but it's never too late. You can start now. Get them. Get them. They're yours to get. But keep well. Keep good. Keep awesome. Be awesome. Stay true to yourself. Thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next one.